kids. No, I'm saying like if I'm drinking, it's just like I plan it. It's not. It's never spontaneous. <laughs> oh yes. Oh, tell us about that. How do you plan it? That's yeah. good feedback. Talk about that's good it. advice. Um, I, alcohol's a big one. Yeah. So getting diagnosed in my twenties and then having to like be on medication for I don't know how long, and it was a experimental thing like oh i'm on this amount of milligrams and oh it's too much so let's try a smaller dose i've i've i've, I've missed that part to be like oh i just want to have a drink you know so i've come up with my own system so i don't have hard liquor one so it it spans between like wine and beer really and truly and then because i take my medication twice a day i would if i'm gonna drink i wouldn't obviously wouldn't take it in the night yeah deal then like i drink a bunch of water just to flush it out of my system but um i never get drunk i don't like I no longer like the feeling of not being in control of my own body. And that's what having a seizure does to you. Yeah. So um, I'm just like, oh, I have a, wine, a glass of wine and my body feels warm right now. Okay, I must stop. <laughs> mm. But like, besides that, that's it. It's not worth like, it. No, it isn't. That's good. 